Hello folks, it's Kane and welcome to Kane's Corner. We are playing more Darkness Falls Hardcore Revenge. Today, we're going to go for a wonder. I don't have a lot of gas. I'm making some sterile bandages. I've got some repair kits. I've got a bit of food, a bit of water. I've got antibiotics and things like that. So what I want to do is I want to go and investigate this road and see where that goes. Because I don't fancy driving through the fucking snow. I'll end up cold and freezing my balls off. Um, but right now, this is like our only town. And it's not very good for looting. So I do want to go and have a look around. What I did find interesting is, you probably can't see it on the map. But around here, I've been digging for, for clay. Uh, so what I was doing during the night, I thought I'll do that. And then I can make some more sterile bandages because I'm going to need them. It's me. And uh, I hit an iron vein, which was quite cool. So I found another patch of iron right next to the trailer. Now, I've got guns. I've got some ammo. I do have my money on me. Okay, good, good, good. What I'm going to do is put you down right around here somewhere. There we go. That's the wrong one. And then we want the storage. And I'm going to throw a load of stuff in here that I don't actually need to carry on me. Because if I die, I lose my shit. So it makes sense to not have it on me. I don't actually need the wrench on me. Uh, I don't actually know why I've got the shovel or the axe, to be fair. But I want to keep those on me. So, well. I think I filled this up already. I can actually check that. Yes, I did. There we go. Oh, yeah. Uh, I installed a cruise control mod. So you press Q. And, uh, yeah, it just, it just goes. I don't actually have my hands on the keyboard right now. That is something that should be in vanilla, in my opinion. Because it just makes it easier. Because uh, all you need to do is worry about, you know, actually, like, turning and shit. So all you do is just tap Q. And set your speed. So when you find a nice straight bit of road and you don't need to turn fast, you can just, you know, set it to slow and off you go. Uh, yeah, I'll just go through here. It should be fine. There we are. Weave through here. Yeah, this was... Uh, this, yeah, like I said, this should just be in vanilla in my opinion. It's... It's good. It's good. I mean, I understand if they don't want it on, like, the bicycle. But just for, like, the normal vehicles, yeah, it should be a thing. I mean, for God's sake, my car has cruise control. I added it myself. But, it, you, you know, most cars now have cruise control. So, considering this is supposed to be set in the future, yes, vehicles should have cruise control. So, we're about to get to where we want to be to follow the road. Um, the reason I'm bringing the wrench with me is so I can wrench cars for gas because I'm probably going to need them where I get to wherever I want to go. So, let's drive out. Put it on sprint mode for the fastest. And let's uh, go out into the mist of doom. Hopefully this doesn't go into the fucking wasteland. And we'll see what we can find, eh? Well, shit. So, it there's a checkpoint there. Um, what it does is it comes down here through the checkpoint. And then loops round into the wasteland. Bollocks. Uh, you know what? I'm going full exploration mode. I'm cross countrying this bitch. Because there's nowhere else to go. I can't go through the snow. If I try and go through the snow, I'm going to end up dealing with hypothermia and shit like that. It's not going to be good. So I'm just going to go cross country and hope to fuck I find something. I was just looking on the map. I forgot I have an open trade route. I'm heading towards that. Hope. I don't know what that was. Hopefully, uh, that'll give us something good that we can go and investigate. But it looks like there might be a massive hill in the way. Right. Well, here we are. Unfortunately, no city. But I found Jen. So that's cool. Uh, there's a load of shit here I can salvage if I want to. So that might be worth doing. A book I already know. I can at least scrap that. Oh, go away. Uh, yeah, we'll just... You know what? Fuck off. There we go. Right, I'll grab this. I don't know if Jen will have anything worth buying, but it's worth a look. 
Uh, that wasn't great. Anything, nothing else in there. Right. Check the cars. You never know. Oh, repair kit and some gas. That's nice. I can definitely use that. That's a scrap iron spear that I don't need. I might sell it. Hello. Goodbye. Really save chests. Okay, I can sell that. Uh, sorry, scrap that even. I'm fucking stuck. Hello? Hi. Just stay down for me. Ah, oh, I'm fucking cream crackered. Anyone else? Yeah, I thought so. Right, come on. Just make sure there's nothing else around me. I might check the map in a minute and see what my coordinates are. That'll give me a good idea on where to go. Right. Okay. So I'm at west and south. So ideally, I need to go back that way. Um, and start going north and east. So I'm going to put a pin in that. And we'll go over here. We'll go and finish this quest off first. Uh, did I loot that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I wanted to check this tent just in case. I know you can get blood bags from them. Uh, but I don't remember if it's a disassemble or what. So there's a tip for you. I'm pretty sure I added it in DF that you could do that. Actually, uh, I do want this couch. I need leather. I'm also going to have the cloth. I need leather to make scrap iron tools. So I might as well get it out of the couch. Because it's here. Should give me a bit. Yeah, two. And that should give me two. That should give me two. And that should give me two. And then I can make uh, scrap iron tools, which I do need to do. It will make things a lot easier. What are you going to give me? Yeah, thought so. Right. Anything in that? Ah, oh, five dukes. Pairs. Yeah, it was pairs. I had to double check that. I'll just loot the cupboards. Poor Jen. I turn up and just loot all her shit. Right, what did I get? So I've got a cooking pot. And a grill. I'm going to throw that away. You know what? I'll scrap that. There we are. Scrap that. And then, no matter where I go, I've now got a cooking pot and a grill so I can actually cook food. So that's actually quite good. I'm quite pleased about that. I mean, I could have just made some in my forge, but uh, I didn't want to. So this saves me doing that. Just take this. I'll check that uh, trunk there in a minute. That might have something in it. All right. I might throw away the rotten meat. Jen, you need to sort out your shit. Um, okay. Might be able to sell that at least. All right. I think we're basically done here. Right, am I wearing anything right now? No, I'm not. Right, I'll wear that. I'll sell that. I'll scrap that. I'm going to keep those other shades because I did have some, but I died. So, I think having spares is a good idea. You have a tomato plant there, Jen. Right, if I remember correctly, you have to go round and in. Like this. There we go. Right, they're working. I do, however, want that. Thank you. Hi, Jen. Well, that didn't take long. There we go. Nice Quest work. done. That's nice. Right. Did I miss that bag? Yes. Wasn't worth it. Right. My bike is out here. Along with a doggo. Ain't taking no chances with a doggo. But now I can skin you for extra um, leather. So, yay. I'm going to throw that away. I'm going to throw that away. I'm going to... Put that away, because pumpkin seeds are a bit of a bugger to get. Oh, yeah, I wanted to sell some of this. Never mind. Uh, do that. 
I'll throw away the one electrical part. I'll throw away the fat. I did throw away the raw meat, didn't I? The uh, Sorry, the spoiled meat is what I meant to say. Looks like I did. Good. Right. Stack the gas. Uh, animal fat electrical parts. Yes, I did. Good. Right. So now I need to go back that way, which is a very, very long drive. But looking at where I am on the map, I think that is the best option. Guess I'll see you when I get all the way over there, eh? I remember why um, I was going to say I felt that the cruise control mod was a quality of life thing. You can actually do it on a controller. If you use a controller with seven days to die, there is actually essentially a button for all cruise control. So it's in the game. It's just not available to keyboard and mouse players, which is, in my opinion, the best way to play the game. So it's kind of fucking annoying. So that's why I installed the mod. It's like, well, fuck you. I'm not plugging a controller in just for that. Also, that was some sick air. Okay, this is the point I set to come to. Now, oh, nearly crashed into that rock. I'm currently not seeing anything, so I think what I'm going to do is just go northeast. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely just going to go northeast, and we'll see uh, what we find, if anything. Like this road. I found this road. If I go this way, it should link me up to the snow, and then I could double back and go the other way. I also saw desert, so... We're finding things. What's this? Is this a city or is this just a little checkpoint thing? Because it really could just be a little checkpoint thing. It's another trader. Okay. It's exactly the same as what I've got, which is Joel. That's fine. We found another trader. Great. I decided a quick pit stop was in order. There's a load of cars here. There's some further down there that aren't quite rendering yet. And there's some this way. Uh, basically, I thought, well, I'll stop and I'll loot them all and grab some gas while I'm here. And anything I don't need, I could just scrap for iron because I'm going to need iron eventually. So it was worthwhile just stopping for all of this. I've left my light on. What have we got in here? Anything good? Not really. Hop seed, though. They could be a bugger to get, so that's not too bad. But yeah, I'm just basically going to wrench this, loot that, wrench it, go all the way down, do all of those. More gas. All good. This isn't a black minivan. Right, that was all the cars. I have 888 gas, and I also am in dire need of a drink. I left all my drinks in the bike, didn't I? Because uh, I did a smart. Doesn't happen very often. Okay, let's go and top up food and water, and then we're going to go out that way. Oh, yeah, and, of course, fill up the bike's gas. Because that was... I'm just going to grab a few extra stones. Because that was damn near a full tank, which makes me very happy. Okay, no, it wasn't. This has got a big tank. Never mind then. I'll just shut up, shall I? Right, so I'm going to need to have, like, have about nine, ten of these, roughly. So we'll just keep doing this. Eight, and then eleven. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Need to get that water nice and high. I'm probably going to pop one of those trail mixers because that reduces... It's either water consumption or food consumption. I don't remember which. When you dig in the XL files, uh, XML files as much as I do, you tend to forget what things do. It's kind of annoying. All right, I'll do that, and then we'll eat one of those. Gives me five food and efficient digestion. And then we'll top up on the yucca because that is better food. I'm going to put the money away as well. Uh, 23. Yep, we're good. Right, off we go again. Turn on that really useful cruise control. And out to what I think is the desert. That's Wasteland. That's Wasteland. Abort. Jesus Christ, I only drove straight into that. But there is desert on the other side, so we could just loop round... And get out and get into it that way. Okay. Oh, that's a tree. Stop fucking the trees. What's wrong with you? Right. I didn't even spot that, Paul. There's fucking forest over there. So this tiny little bit of wasteland of just fuck you. And then you get into the desert and there's forest over there. I really kind of want to try and get to that forest. Because. All right, maybe I can't get to that forest. Oh, God, that's close. I don't want any of that. Thank you, sir. Oh, no. Stop hurt, trying to hurt me. 
Okay, yeah, we'll just get back on the road and follow that and hope I don't die of dehydration in the meantime. Aha, that looks a bit better. Looks quite a lot better. All right. Potential looting paradise. Let's see if we can find anywhere to set up a home away from home. And uh, then we'll go looking and see what we can actually loot, more importantly. Because, goddamn, I want some books. I just found my favorite POI. Pretty sure this is it. Yes, it is. Well, I found where I'm living for now. So what we'll do is we'll go up here. We'll break in. Uh, get out of this fucking heat. And we will look at setting up a little house in here. Just because I like the place and uh, it's right on the edge of the city. So hopefully it shouldn't get any... Well, we shouldn't get too many zombies wandering over and saying hello. I hope. Hi. Oh, there he is. Hello, sir. Right. I need you to fucking die. Thank you. Right, there we go. Now I can close that. Jesus Christ, it went a bit dark, didn't it? Right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to very quickly tidy up in here. Uh, I'll probably leave that uh, so I can throw down a couple of chests. Then I can empty my bag and I can empty my bike. And uh, we can, I'll set up a little campfire as well, actually, because I'm going to need that. And then we're all good. We've got a little tiny base away from where I should, be, where I do actually live. And uh, we can do some exploration, which I'm absolutely looking forward to doing. There we go, cleaned up. Right, so now I need a couple of chests. I'll say grab three. And I want to make a bedroll. I've marked where I currently live, so that's fine. And I want a campfire. So give me that, give me that, give me that. So let's do one, two, three. Yeah, whatever. Um, I'll put the campfire there. Throw that in there and that in there. There we go. That gives me a bit of extra room. Bed roll can go there. There we go. We have a sort of home. It's better than nothing. And now I could just throw all of this into here because I don't bloody need it. Actually, give me the pipes. I might need them to repair my pipe guns so those are worth keeping on me. That can all stay in there. And I hear something outside absolutely losing its mind. Okay, uh, right, so now we could go through this POI very, very slowly, clear it out, bring all the stuff up here, and then this is going to be where we live. That is the plan. Uh, Swaltering is not in my plan. Let's get the fuck inside. Jesus Christ. There we go. Okay. I got excited for a minute. Really wasn't worth it. That is, though, that. Yeah, that will let me get into the wasteland, not the wasteland, uh, the snow. That's a good find. I know there's a zombie over there usually. I'll turn that off as well. Yeah, right there. Oh, for God's sake. I'm not even being noisy, and he still woke up. I hate the trigger system in this. So for those who don't know, the POIs have sleeper volumes, which is what that is. And there's there's also trigger volumes. If you walk into the trigger volume, it wakes them up, even if you don't make noise. It's stupid and annoying, and I hate it. It's like, yeah, we decided stealth is too powerful, so we've done this, so fuck you. Okay. Why don't you just give the zombies better sensors? If somebody wants to spend all the points and, like, go slow uh, to properly take advantage of stealth, then let them. That's how I think about it, anyway. Or reduce stealth damage. There's an option. So it's not, like, massively overpowered compared to, like, everything else. Yes, I'm hot, I know. Only in terms of temperature, though. Right. Oh, hi. You're in the wrong climate, aren't you?
Good, good, good. I'm running out of iron arrows. Iron bolts, even. There we go. Give me that. Give me that. That and that. Free wood. Thank you. Nothing there. Right. There is someone outside. So what I'm going to do... Is that... Someone out here as well. Let's see if that works. Just have to wait for the particle effect to fuck off so I can walk past. Someone else outside there. I can hear them. That was a pie. That's mine. Get rid of these for the free wood. That'll be leather. Yes, it is. Good. I need that. Wooden bow. I did actually want to make one of those. So, yay. Uh, don't know if I'll keep it. Because I've got a crossbow now. And I like crossbows. Just doing a very quick rummage. Don't need that cooking pot. I'll probably scrap it. Raw materials is way more useful to me right now. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Stupid helmet. There we go. I dealt with that all right. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. That is locked. We don't care. Downstairs. Quick check. Nothing. Good. Move on. Didn't expect to find that as soon as I opened the door. I probably should have because I'm not exactly being stealthy. But I didn't. Give me that. Give me that. Uh, oh, P225. Ooh. Sorry, advanced pistol, I call it now. Okay. Uh, ooh. I don't actually have much left in the 762, so I'm going to swap that out. That's good. I just saw a comment that was saying I need better guns. Well, there's a better gun for a fucking start. Uh, I'll read that. That'll go nicely with the gun I just found. I am literally looting everything because I can, just so you know. Open this and down we go. Couple of mollies left if I need them. There's a rad there. That works. Sit down. There was another rad. I think I got them all. Yeah, I think I did. Excellent. Can't lose that. There's another cooking... No, sorry, cooking grill, not cooking pot. I nearly said cooking pot. Stop myself then for a moment. Give me that bookcase. Nice, nice. Very good. And then I could crouch. Uh, scrap that, scrap that, scrap that. I've got a lockpick. That wasn't bad hit fire, if I do say so myself. Grab all of this just in case. Hey, I had money in that one. That doesn't happen often. Oh, I am reloaded. Good. Sneaky, sneaky. There's usually something in here. Nope, he's there. Big boys get big guns. And then pokes. Right, reload. Do that now before I forget. Oh, I broke the reload animation. Fantastic. Uh, reload that. That's Dawn. Right, back to sneak. 
we drop down here. I always clear this out. I don't think you technically... That's a cop. Not anymore, it's not. That's a stun baton. Hmm. Yeah, all right. I'll give it a go. Worth a fucking laugh. Give me that. Okay. Give me that. Something is asleep. I can hear it. Any more? Yep. I think that's all of them. Oh, that was a scrap shovel. That's one thing less I need to make. That was a shitload of books. Read that, scrap that, read that, read that, scrap that. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We are good. Let's grab all these. Right, move forwards, drop down, crouch. Actually, do it again. Sometimes the crouch bugs out a little bit, so it's worth just undoing and redoing it. Okay. There's always shit around here. I just don't remember where. Right there, in fact. I don't entirely know why the party girls are down here, but, you know. That was a couple of decent knives. Okay, cool. A spare for when I... Hmm. That sounds like a wandering horde. I need to get upstairs fucking fast. Uh, right. Get rid of you. Don't rush it, because if I rush it, I'm going to make down here way worse. But that sounds like a wandering horde upstairs. Right. That is. Okay, how am I going to deal with this? Because my instinct is to just throw everything in a fucking box and run. Uh, there they are. All right. Yep, there they are. I see him. That is a lot of shit. I'm doing this, which might seem stupid. But I can't get out that way. So, if I run... And try and go out the way I came in... For a start, it'll give me a bit of breathing room. Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. How's my health? All right. Infected, though. Bit of a problem. Oh, shit. They found another way to get to me. Uh, fuck. I need somewhere to put shit down. 
I need somewhere to put shit down, like right now. Uh, box. Scrap that for a fucking start. Bookcase. Yes, I am preparing to die because, be totally honest, I may not be able to deal with this. So, it's better to just dump as much shit as I can and make sure I don't lose it than it is to try and fight it and die and lose all the shit. Hopefully that makes sense. There we go. I'm up. I'm up. I'll just jump over him. I fucking missed the jump. I missed that hole. There we go. I couldn't save everything. God damn it. Of course, now the problem is they're underneath me. Hmm. But at least I managed to store most of the good shit. I've lost some, that's that, which is annoying, but I I think I managed to store the, the P225, but I lost the ammo. Oh, well. Unfortunately, I can't really go deal with that right now. I need to go and uh, collect some stone and wooden shit and, uh, well, you know, try and rebuild what I'm missing. I did put stuff away. Good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump on my bike and go for a bit of a drive. Start collecting more resources, but for now, I think that is where we're going to leave this episode. And at the very least, because I always restart the game for recording, that load of fuckers will have despawned. Thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed it. Big thanks to the YouTube members and the patrons whose names are on screen now, as their support has helped keep the channel going and also helped with mod development. Always, always appreciated. Please do the usual. Like, subscribe, comment, bell, and hopefully I'll see you for the next one. Cheers.